What's up, Tony? What's bothering you? I just... I just think there are some lines you said, and you just don't cross them. Period. Otherwise, you just keep crossing them, one after another, you know? Until you're just lost. And we're partners. And that matters. That means something to me. But I can't do this, Joe. I'm gonna tell the captain about Daphne, about wiping your prints off. I'm gonna tell him what we did. I believe you didn't kill that girl. Tell him with me. It's the right thing to do. Well, you're right about one thing, Tony. I didn't kill that girl. And I'm not gonna let anything get in the way of me finding out who did. Where's your pen? Huh? Your pen. The one with your initials on it. The one that your wife gave you. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> That's right. It's probably at the crime lab by now. Forensics picked it up. You left it at the scene. And that um, last pack of cigarettes you smoked. The one with your fingerprints all over the wrapper. You left your smokes there, too. No. no. No, 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 no. You came to me, remember? I what? Yeah. Yeah, because you fucked some whore. And holy shit, found her dead the next morning. And you asked me to help you wipe the place clean to cover your tracks. And I should never have done it. Well, as anyone knows, I am nothing if not a loyal partner. You have two years in the precinct. How do you think they're going to believe me or you? Especially considering all the evidence. You fucking scumbag. You planned it? You fucked me and you planned this? No. Nobody is gonna get fucked. You see, that is the beauty of it. When the crime lab files its report, I'll tell the captain that you were shaken up by what we found at the scene. You know, I saw you have a smoke and touch a few things before you put on the gloves. It's a simple mistake. The worst you're gonna get is a verbal reprimand. 